How's it going everyone and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to properly add Google Analytics as a tracker for your Elementor plugin over at WordPress. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So the first thing that you guys need to do is you want to make sure that you're logged into WordPress as well as your Analytics account as administrators. So once you guys are here, if you don't already have the Elementor plugin installed, um, you guys can head over to the uh, WordPress app store like so. Click on add plugin type Elementor, it's like that, it should show up just right here. Okay, so here it is. It's this one right here with over 6,700 ratings. We're going to click on install and activate, <clears throat> just like so. And basically let WordPress work its magic so they can properly integrate um, Elementor over to um, our WordPress account. So you guys want to click on Manage Plugin, and this will redirect you back to the home page where you get to uh, configure the settings for Elementor. Okay, so normally it would ask you for uh, to sign up for an account, but let's just skip that. Okay, so here's what the site editor looks like, and this is where we'll be adding our Google Analytics code or tracking code. So I want to head back to WordPress like so, uh, click on Elementor. Click on custom code, which is this one right here. And normally this feature would be an added paid feature for uh, Elementor, assuming you guys have the premium package, but um, here's what it looks like. Here's what the dashboard looks like. So you go dashboard, Elementor custom code, and then you would want to extract the code from Google Analytics, usually found under data streams. So it's this one here. And here's the measurement ID, which is also the tracking ID. And copy it over, paste it in this box right here with the custom uh, for the custom code. And you guys are done. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So with all that said, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.